G'day, it's Jamie again. I'm really excited to talk to you about this week's theme, failing. You know what? Failing is not a bad thing. Failing is a good thing. Someone once told me that when we fail, we actually succeed when it comes to exercise. And I'd suggest that's true. When we fail, we learn, we correct, we grow, we actually get what's called adaptations. Our body responds to failing. And I would suggest that failing in training is succeeding. Do you know our muscles rip and break down when we train them to failure? But then the good news is they repair and they grow stronger and they equip us to be better for next time. So this week's theme is failing. And this week's exercise, I'm hoping you can help take it to failure. It's going to be hard. You might need some mental toughness. You might need some of that focus. The exercise is called the wall sit. Let me show you how that works. An oldie but a goodie, the wall sit. Come with me. I'm gonna choose a wall. This is just a small wall, but you know what, it'll do. You can also choose a long wall. It can happen indoors or outdoors. What I'm gonna do is take my feet about shoulder width. I'm gonna sit down, place my lower back and my shoulder blades against the wall, and I'm just gonna hang out here. Here's some things I want you to try and avoid. Keep those hands free. You can fold the arms, arms out, hang them by the side. You'll see here that I'm trying to create two right angles. It's really important that our knee sits over our ankle. If you'd like an extra challenge, check this out. Ah, lift up the toes. That will really work the legs. And this is where I need to really start focusing and breathing because I can feel failure coming on. Remember, to succeed, we need to fail. Hold on. Oh, that'll do me. Oh, there's two ways we can finish this exercise. We can quit or we can fail. I want to encourage you to do the, the second of the two because when we fail, we succeed. All the best. So there you have it. There's the wall sit. Simple, effective. This one's going to burn. Now, you know what? There's two ways you could tap out here. You could either quit or you could go to fail. And I'm really encouraging the second, yeah? Have a look at how I'd love your week to look. Check it out. Monday, I want you to do a sub max. That means don't go to fail on these days, but I'm going to encourage you to max out on these days. And you know how it works. Friday is our max effort Friday. So it looks like this. I want one times max effort. Max effort means your best. Remember this, fail is to fail, is to succeed. And maybe you could do that twice during the week. I'd recommend Wednesday and Friday, keeping Monday, Tuesday and Thursday. I'm calling it a submax, which means don't quite push your body to its extreme, its fullest, its, its, its maximum on those days. But can you bring it on a Wednesday and a Friday? So there's your healthy tip. Celebrate your wins. It's really important to do that in life, with friends and family, but also in your training. So when you fail, slap a high five, celebrate your wins, keep it COVID safe. You might even want to, again, whip out your journal. You might even want to document that down on one of your devices. Celebrate your wins, keep it COVID safe, take it to failure.